the station that's taking action for you. This is ABC Action News at 530. You don't have to be a celebrity to get help. Two local doctors implanted the deep brain stimulator and a local man to help him achieve relief from his symptoms. Life for Pierre Cooley changed drastically with his diagnosis of Parkinson's disease 15 years ago. At one point, his shaking and other symptoms got so bad, he says he feared for his safety while traveling. I was falling down in Australia. I just suddenly would go back, and, and, and there I was. And it was terrible on street corners. And, uh, so, I mean, it's embarrassing too. That changed when he had a deep brain stimulator implanted in his brain. Well, during deep brain stimulation, the patient is awake and we place an electrode into a small spot in the brain that will turn off their symptoms. We watch their symptoms go away during surgery and then we hook them up to a generator uh, later on so it can turn off their symptoms after surgery. Dr. McCallop's partner demonstrates how the stimulator works. Using a computer and a device in Mr. Cooley's chest that is much like a pacemaker, she can turn the brain electrodes on or off and adjust the voltage. Right now, what I'm going to do is turn off oh boy. his electrode. Sorry, you're off. Almost immediately, you see Mr. Cooley's tremors begin again. A few exercises also show how his symptoms return. Once the stimulator is turned on again... And pretty much right away, his tremor got much better. Mr. Cooley realizes he'll never have his full life back, but says the stimulator has helped him become more active and... It made, made it possible for me to take less medication. And by the way, you can catch Michael J. Fox's one-hour special, Adventures of an Incurable Optimist, tonight at 10, right here on ABC.